Greetings to the free world, known to man. We're back at you one more again. Since it's Memorial Day, and we're one of the lucky ones who made it back alive, uh, we wanted to talk to you good people about being a United States Marine and the apparent citizenship points that are afforded to you. Now let's back this up. See, there's this thing that happens on Instagram and Facebook and whatnot. When we make posts that are about social inequalities, white supremacy, well, white ignorance, um, colonialism, the whole nine, right? We make these posts or we'll make these comments on different threads of other people's posts. And someone's just firing off at us all these facts that they've gotten from, you know, Fox and Friends, Bill O'Reilly, you know, the typical stuff. You know, the stuff that we've already heard all before, the make-believe stuff that white people really think is going on. Yeah, they start firing off these things. And when we combat those with actual facts, statistics, and data, they want to always say, well, where's your source for that? Where's this? But it, See, you know, when Fox says it, the source, it's automatically vetted to you people. But us, in our source, which is normally independent sources, we don't, we don't rely on quote-unquote black media because you'll never believe it. We come to you with data and facts and then personal anecdotes and you're still like, oh, that's not enough. But the citizenship points thing. See, what takes place is these uh, individuals, whether they're white or coons, and we're gonna, we're gonna, we're doing our best to quit calling black people coons, but black people, please help us out. Quit being coons. White folks and coons alike, they'll start creeping on our page and come across our picture in our dress blue uniform. And all of a sudden, yeah, that's right. Oh, well, I'd like to thank you for your service. And, uh, you know, I, uh, I was gonna join the Marine Corps, but <laughs> every Marine that's listening to this has heard I was gonna join the Marine Corps, but that story, that start, that, that lead off, you've heard it, but you didn't. So, why is it that regular black face dude Rex, his opinion needs a million sources, it needs anecdotes, it needs, and it's still unreliable, but Marine Rex gets, well, you know, uh, I never really thought of it that way, and you know, uh, you ever, nobody ever told me, and, uh, um, well, gee, I'm, I'm really glad that we had this exchange today. Like, the whole, the whole thing, it's a 180. But why? Why is it a regular black man can't voice something so eloquently packaged with facts and data, and you sit there and go, wow, damn. It's like as if the fact that we're a veteran of the Marine Corps our value in stock we have extra citizenship points because just a regular black man's voice it has no value and a lot of these people they're not even veterans they haven't even been in the boy scouts they they like volunteer on christmas or thanksgiving just to say that they volunteered on thanksgiving and christmas so you know they can uh not you know we, we give back to the community get that you don't sit yo anyhow citizenship points check it out and, and then please, civilians, please, white people and coons alike, when you're wrong, be wrong. Have the integrity. There's this thing we learned in the Marine Corps. It's JJ did tie buckle. We'll say it real slow. JJ did tie buckle. Use your little favorite search engine and look that up. One of the items on that list is I for integrity. Own some. If you're wrong, be wrong. If you didn't know, hey, say, I, you know what? I know I just said what I said or I shared what I shared, but I really didn't know and I thought, and oh, my bad. At least my bad, if not, I'm sorry. I'm sorry it would do better, but it, we'll take a my bad in 2016 because we know that's like pulling teeth from white folks and coons. Oh, woo. All right, yeah, with all that said, hope everybody uh, had a safe Memorial Day weekend and you got to get your drink on and spend time with your loved ones because, well, there are a lot of guys that didn't make it back. And um, I'm really glad that uh, I did. I did. But yeah, we're going to keep it moving. Peace.